George Dickel bourbon eight year. Gets a lot of hate. I don't know why. Hell right. Damn child proof zippers on these things still. <laughs> I think I found it, but then it doesn't work. Come off a top. Oh, good job. It's child proof. Well, it says like a lot. Adult bourbon proof. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. I got to the court. Let's, let's, let's throw that anywhere. Someone else will pick it up. Pop. Yeah, they will. Pop his cork. Uh, <laughs> uh, almost knocked yourself out with that one. <laughs> I about Tyson to myself. <laughs> Damn, son. Uh, hope it delivers the same knockout punch. Yeah, we shall find out. I mean, we like most of the other George Dickles. Yeah. Not Most so much. Not all of them. Yeah, the, the recipe eight's a little weak, but we started with 12. That about knocked us upside the head. Yeah, the single barrel's good. The barrel select is not bad. The 15's really good. That 17, 17 no. Oh. 17 is outrageously yeah. good. I didn't get a chance to try the 18 yet. We're looking for a pour of it for a decent price. So if anyone in the Colorado or Denver area specifically knows of a place that you can get Dickel 18 for a decent price of pour. Leave it in the comments because we're trying to find that one at a bar somewhere. Or if we could find four other people to kick in on an even split, we'll buy a bottle and split it. Still a hundred and something bucks each. It might taste like shit. Might be <laughs> you good. I'm saying. You never but know. that's all right. We like Dickel. Most yeah. people don't. Ooh. Mm. Toasty. And a little fruit. Yeah. <laughs> It's brighter than I remember. Yeah. Man, I'm getting like real bright apples, like red granny apples. I was getting like Granny a, does do red apples, right? No, granny's green. Granny's green. Well, who's red? <laughs> red delicious. Red delicious. Yes. If you know the answer to that, let me know. <laughs> I need some education. Yeah, we only know two kinds of apples, apparently. <laughs> mm -hmm. Candy apples and caramel apples. <laughs> no, that does smell like an that apple orchard. smells good. Hill but uh, like a buttery kind of apple, like oh, like stewed apples, baked apples. Yeah, stewed apples. Oh, is that how they? It's just stewed is in like a pan with like sugars and stuff. Okay, because I don't like baked apples. They put them in tin foil and. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. Kind of the same thing. Kind of same concept. But yeah, that's eight away. That's delicious. That's shit what I'm getting out of this glass. Cheers. That's pretty sweet. That apple transferred right over for it me. Did. A little a little charcoal on it though. Like a little barrel char. On not that, not a bad way. On that finish. Yeah, just cut in there at the end. Hmm. And a real, real quick finish too. It's not a lingering one. Yeah, that's not too bad. It's not bad at all. A little thin, but it's to be expected, man. It's not it's not a super high proofer, is it? Ninety? Yeah, it's yeah. only ninety proof. So they proofed it down, understandably, but the flavor is good. There's nothing wrong with the flavor, but if you're looking for a, you know, complete, you know, kind of the whole viscosity and blah, 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 long finish, mega notes everywhere, then, you know, you're not going to really get it off of a, a 90 difficult. proofer. Yeah, and especially a different number. I still like it, though. I could I could easily drink it, man. It's it's no drain pour, that's for sure. That's it. Yeah, I agree there. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah, yeah. It got a little bit of legs in there. Yeah, it's not it's not terrible. Like I said, it's just a little thin for me. But at 90 proof, I don't expect a full bodied bourbon. So well, for not. George Dickel attempted bourbon, which as far as I'm concerned, everything in Tennessee is still bourbon. Well, it's bourbon with an extra process added, so they gotta call it whiskey. Yeah. But it's still good shit. Maybe they didn't do that process in it. I don't They did. Did they? Yeah, all Dickel gets that process. Still produced by Cal. Okay. Well, I guess that don't tell me shit. No. <laughs> and that stuff's too damn small to read. So five minutes in, he's going to read the label. Yeah, well, <laughs> not really, because I can't see it. Even with these new glasses, man. That's <laughs> but just, he's still trying, that, even that, though that, he admitted he can Yeah. I can read the front. George Dickel Bourbon Whiskey. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Aged eight years. <laughs> You're not giving them anything new. <laughs> it's already been said. <laughs> I'm not here to educate you. <laughs> 
<laughs> or get an education, apparently. That's right. I done graduated back in what, 1912? I don't fucking remember. <laughs> Beep. Oh, I can't say that. Oh, I can't wait. We it. I'll say what I want because you know what? I'm Johnny Fish. <laughs> anyway, whatever. It's good. You buy it. Share that crap with your friend. Yeah, man. Cheers. Cheers. Yep, that's good shit.